Power's your hands. Keep that elbow tucked in, and let's go for it. Oh! <laughs> Pretty girl. What are you doing? That's brushing my hair. You're brushing your hair or is mommy brushing your hair? Mama. Is she gonna do a pretty pony? Mm -hmm. Or like a braid or she's what? Gonna do a, um, she's gonna do a little um, uh, pony right there. Uh huh. And then she's gonna do a braid. Oh, you gonna look Remember beautiful. What kind of braid I'm gonna do? Uh, no. Fish tail. Um, and look, you guys, at Peyton's new outfit. That is so cool. And guess who else is matching you? Whoa, bam! Good morning, Liv! Good morning! How are you? Good. Let me see your pony ponytail braid, fishtail braid. Wow. Mom knows how to do that. I wish I knew how to do that. Normally, you guys, I do her hair just in a straight pony. But when Mom does her hair, they get the hook up, huh? Found it. I like your cute dress too. Actually, I could probably teach you how to do that, babe. It's very easy. The fishtail? Yes. Yeah, no, thank you. I don't think I could pull it off. You could definitely pull it off. It's like the easiest braid. How are you feeling, by the way? Um, I'm feeling okay. I talked to my doctor today and she told me some things I can do, so I'm hoping that when I do those things, I'll start to get even more better, but. Is that word more better? More better is a great word. I like it. I'm a little bit under the weather still, so keep those prayers coming. If you pray, pray for me. Well, good morning to you guys. Today has been like Operation Clean the House and get Christmas stuff out of here. Santa, bye bye. Tomorrow, I believe, we're actually going to take down the Christmas tree. Liv is a little bit sad about taking down our Christmas tree, but we have one more day to enjoy Christmas, and then we have to wait another 360 something days. Because that's a whole year. But one more day to enjoy the Christmas tree, and then we gotta take it down. I actually wanted to take it down today to get it out because our garbage and stuff comes today. So that means we're gonna have to have like the tree in the trash can for like a week, which is gonna be a bummer. But one more day of Christmas, and that'll be fun. And then we'll have Christmas another year. <laughs> and guess what? Next Christmas we're gonna have another baby here. That's still so crazy to think. This was our last Christmas as just you, me, mom, and Peyton. And then, whoa, goodness <laughs> gracious. Thanks. Okay, okay, no thank you. Sorry. You're like seven years old Sorry. and it's so heavy now. I can't do that. Sorry. <laughs> you guys, I have a basketball hoop now and we're oh, so sissy. And yeah. now we're gonna play basketball. Yeah, I'm so excited because now we both have a basketball hoop. <laughs> That is pretty cool. Well, I think we need to. I think we need to raise it a little bit higher, huh? No. Yeah, so you can start practicing. No. All right, Liv. Oh, Liv's as tall as it. It's literally as tall as your head. Look, it stand next to it, Liv. It literally bonk your head. <laughs> Let's raise it up a little bit so you can practice. You can slam dunk. Ooh, nice. All right, you want to practice on this size for a little bit, and then we'll raise it up. Yeah. Okay. Nice. I can't even jump that high. It's so low. We are trying to get some sunlight and some fresh air today because we have been cooped up in the house the last couple days and we want to be able to just have a good time outside. It's like 80 degrees out here, you guys. Um, also, it is very nice. Also, I raised the hoop for Olivia because I want her to start practicing on a bigger hoop so that when she goes back to her practices and her games, it's like easy peasy for her. Easy peasy, can you say easy peasy lemon squeezy? Okay. <laughs> oh, nice. She even added in a little of her own there right there. All right, Liv, let's see if you can make your first shot of the day, okay? We gotta remember all the stuff that we taught. So your feet have to be planted like they're supposed to be pointed to the hoop. How's your hands? Keep that elbow tucked in, and let's go for it. Oh! <laughs> that was awesome, babe! I love it! Look at Molly, you guys. Molly! What are you doing? Whoa, whoa, here she goes. Here she goes. Here she goes. <laughs> I think she was like looking for some squirrels or something. What was she doing? I think she was trying to, trying to look for flies. Some flies? Maybe lizards. 
Because we have lizards in our house. Yeah, that's scary. <laughs> no, it's not scary. A lizard? Kind of scary. Maybe a little bit. You want to raise a little higher? Mm -hmm. Okay. Five. Okay, let's raise it to five feet for you, okay? Mm -hmm. There's five. Let's see if we can get it there. That's really high. I think you can make it though, Peyton. Okay. All right, do what we taught you. Arm behind the ball. Keep your elbow tucked in. Spread those feet a little bit closer. There you go. And let's get a shot. Yeah! <laughs> She's killing it. She's doing good, huh? Probably because she has a good big sister to help her. She watches you, huh? Do you watch your sister? Let me see another one. Look at her, you guys. Not, oh! Keep trying, okay? Good dribbling too, kid. WNBA, watch out for my girls. Did it again? Yes, you I keep, keep making shots. You're so good. That is like sincere and genuine like excitement from Peyton. She is so pumped up because she's not had a hoop that she's been able to like really shoot on and she's been watching live play. So she is like, <laughs> yeah, you are doing so good. Watch I'm so proud of you guys. You guys are both so good. Look at that, you guys. Liv is getting good too. And that is a higher rim than normal thing she needs to shoot on. So she's actually doing a lot better even I on the rim that she's not even supposed to be on. You made it again? No way. Another one? Yes, I keep getting like 100,000. You're doing so good, babe. pregnancy update. So I figured since today is another one of those days where we're kind of just staying in, uh, since I'm not feeling well, I would give you some updates today. Uh, girls, do you guys have any questions about the baby? How is the baby? How is the baby? Well, I'm pretty sure the baby's doing good. It's growing. Last time we had the ultrasound, they were saying it was growing and everything looked good. The heartbeat was strong. How big is the baby? Well, so I've been kind of like sharing with the girls like updates on like the growth of the baby. And last week, do you remember what the baby was size-wise? A raspberry. Yes, last week the baby was this size, the size of a raspberry. And now, and now it is, well, on my little thing it said the size of a green olive, but this blackberry is kind of like the same size. So if you see the difference between raspberry and blackberry, that is how much the baby has grown. Isn't that crazy? It's so tiny. I know, right? I haven't really noticed any kind of like cravings or anything, but I have been sick, so I haven't been really able to taste any foods or anything lately, so there isn't anything that's tasting bad or good to me because I can't taste. Something funny that Liv told me today was that she wished that I had three babies in my tummy. I meant two. Oh, you meant two. She's like, I wish you had three babies in your tummy so then you can have four kids. I, would be, I was like, that would be five kids. And she's like, oh, I meant to. <laughs> but there is only one baby in there. It was actually pretty funny. Um, we went to do the ultrasound, if you guys saw that video. Um, the doctor asked, or the doctor was like, 
that's the first thing we'll check for is it one or two and it was just like the weirdest like caught me off guard because no doctor has ever said that to me before well, i am looking and i'm looking to see if there's one or two and it looks like there's one and there's the baby right there and you can see the baby's heartbeat right there one last update i have not had a lot of morning sickness which is very good and I'm very thankful for. I've had some nauseousness, but not actually like getting sick. Only one time did I actually get sick. So um, I kind of know from my previous pregnancies that when I start to feel nauseous, I just need to eat something, even if I don't feel like eating, because that kind of helps settle my stomach. So I've been trying to just do that when I start to feel it come on. But another thing, actually, I wanted to show you guys. I'm gonna have Jeff help me out here. Um, is my little baby bump. I feel like I've been popping out just a little bit. Oh, wow. <laughs> I, got, I got a baby bump too, you guys want to see. <laughs> see, like let's a, compare. That's Dad's, as far as I can push it out though. Dad's baby bump. Oh gosh, that's so gross. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry guys, you haven't seen it. <laughs> and then I wanted to show you this because I think some of you have been asking like, are you showing it or whatever? Anyways. All right, so there it is. Just Not very little. big. Just a little baby bump. Little baby Since bump. The baby's just the size of like a blackberry. <laughs> Not a very big bump yet, That's but so it's cute. growing, huh? It's gonna grow this big. Uh huh. It's gonna be like this big. This. Ah, ah, crazy. <laughs> you guys, we are snuggling on the couch, and we are gonna end today's vlog. If you liked today's video, I have a down question. Down. What is it? How big is a baby? Hmm. I don't know. Maybe big as an olive. Mm hmm. A green olive. A green olive. And let me know in the comments if you think it's a boy or a girl. If you like this video, give it a thumbs, thumbs up. up. Subscribe if you're new. And see you guys <laughs> Bye. Peace.